Good evening, NCASA. My name is Mary Ledford, and I am a sophomore at Grace Creek High School in Hope Mills, North Carolina. I'm so excited today to run for president-elect on this new virtual platform. Here at Grace Creek, we highly value leadership development. We have been an NCAC member school since 2005 and have attended nearly every event ever since. We have a very supportive staff that shares our desires to both learn and teach leadership skills to students that will fundamentally improve their future professional careers. From this support, we have been able to hold, hold district and state chairs. Our council has experience in holding district convention and holding the first vice president position multiple times. That's why we believe we are highly qualified to hold this position. Grace Creek High has intimately seen the effects of leadership education on our own school campus and in student lives. I can personally attest to this. I've been an active student council member for five years. I also hold my council's desire to share the NCAC's knowledge with as many students and advisors as possible. As I've held multiple workshops at both district and state convention, I have also been a junior counselor at the Emerging Leaders Conference and have consistently held executive board positions at my home council. In this position, my council will strive to improve school attendance and recruit new schools to become members. We will do so by reaching out to schools that were previous members and by reaching out to schools in districts that are underrepresented as we want all schools to have a voice and the ability to also run for office as it gives students and schools an invaluable experience. In our second year in this position, we are fully confident in our ability to hold a great conference virtually or in person. Our council consistently attends state conventions, so we have a good grasp on the weight of this responsibility. As we know, the duties of president-elect in their first year is to run election procedures. Because of our past offices, we know how important it is to be precise and diligent in this area and are ready to do so. In short, Grace Creek High School can't wait to be able to fill these responsibilities with hard work and passion. And all we need to make it happen is your vote. This is Grace Creek High School. Hopefully, it's the site of the 2023 State Convention. All right, so let's talk. I've been in student council way too long. Like, way, way, way too long. Grace Creek High School itself has been an NCAC member school since 2005. And I've been in student council since 2017. Again, way too long. I'm not supposed to be showing you a fun video of what our school and our council has to offer. But here's the thing. that into to our advantage and hopefully in 2023 we can see you here for now I'll show you around this is our cafeteria where you might have eaten lunch at the 2017 Central District Conference <laughs> our auditorium can see up to 510 people this is our SGA room, where we do lots of hard work. It doesn't look like it right now, but trust me, we do hard work. And this is our front office where our supportive administration lies. Unfortunately, she's not here today, but we'll insert a picture. So now let's get down to the nitty gritty. You know we've been an NCAC member for a long time. You know I've been an NCAC member for a long time. We've been to plenty of events, we've held plenty of positions. 
And now what we want you to know, most importantly, is that we want to hold an approachable, non-pretentious, informative, and fun convention for new and old leaders because it is an irreplaceable experience and we want you to have it right here at Grace Creek High School.